Let us pray, dear brothers and sisters, to God the Almighty Father, that he bless and sanctify this oil, so that all who are outwardly anointed with it may be inwardly transformed and come to share in eternal salvation. O God, author of all growth and spiritual progress, receive in your goodness the grateful homage that the Church joyfully offers to you through our voice. For in the beginning, you commanded that the earth bring forth fruit-bearing trees, among which olive trees would arise as providers of this most rich oil, so that their fruit might serve for sacred chrism. In the spirit of prophecy, David foresaw the sacraments of your grace, and sang of the oil that would gladden our faces. After the world's offenses were washed away by the flood, a dove announced the restoration of peace on earth with the olive branch, foreshadowing the gift to come. In the last days, all this has been clearly revealed when every offense is removed through the waters of baptism. The anointing with this oil causes our faces to be joyful and serene. You also commanded your servant Moses to make his brother Aaron a priest by pouring this oil upon him after he had been washed in water. Still greater dignity was added to this when your son, Jesus Christ our Lord, insisted that he be washed by John in the waters of the Jordan and sent the Holy Spirit from on high in the likeness of a dove. You declared by the witness of the same voice that followed that you were well pleased with him, your only begotten son. And you were seen to confirm clearly the prophet David had foretold in song when Christ would be anointed with the oil of gladness above his companions. Therefore we beseech you, O Lord, be pleased to sanctify with your blessing this oil in its riches, and to pour into it the strength of the Holy Spirit, with the powerful working of your Christ. From his name it is received, the name of prison, and with it you have anointed your priests, prophets, priests, and martyrs. May you confirm the chrism you have created as a sacred sign of perfect salvation and life for those to be made new in the spiritual waters of baptism. May those formed into a temple of your majesty by the holiness infused through this anointing and by the cleansing of the stain of their first birth be made fragrant with the innocence of a life pleasing to you. May these, those anointed with the royal, priestly, and prophetic dignity be clothed with the garment of an incorruptible gift in keeping with the sacrament you have established. May this oil be the chrism of salvation for those born again of water and the Holy Spirit, and may make them partakers of eternal life and sharers of heavenly glory through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. 